it's easier to make it wider. That, uh, that brush doesn't carry enough oxide to make it all the way around, so... There's one. And now I'll make a little wider one outside that just to kind of set it off. Now, I hit the rim with my brush way back when, so I figured that I'd clean that up last. So I'll do that right now. Otherwise that mark will show. It'd be nice if I didn't have to take all the glaze off, but most of the time you do with cobalt, it penetrates so deeply. And that's one of the reasons it's so beautiful. So there's a nice, solid, clear line. Now I'll clean this up one more time. Now what we're going to do is we're going to put a clear over the top of this and that sandwiches the oxides between a glaze so that the oxides will never be rough and we'll have a nice clean surface in order to wash it or to clean the sink. So you want a nice glossy smooth surface to be able to clean. I don't think this design is going to shake up any of the Ming Dynasty potters. They're probably not going to be jealous but I'll probably get a cup of tea out of it. So uh, that's pretty much it. And this is just done from, I've done a lot of these designs and I have a kind of an idea of what I want them to look like and, and, and how. And um, you just do it. So now it's time to glaze, so I'm gonna glaze it and um, we'll go to the next step. So because this is all hand drawn, it's not measured, it's all seen by eye, it's not perfect, or it is perfect, but it's not absolutely balanced. And so each sink, even if I did this design right now on the same size sink again, would be slightly different. The leaves would be a little different, uh, the texture might be a little different, the, the, the deepness of the cobalt on one flower to the next might be different. Even the spacing might be a little different. So if you order a match or a pair, you know that they're going to be harmonious, but they're not going to be a duplicate because there's no way to duplicate art. You can't ask an artist to paint exactly the same painting. Well, unless you're that guy that paints light. What's his name? Anyway, so I don't do that. Thanks. All right, we're, we're, we're ready to glaze this sink, and um, we're going to cover these oxides up. Uh, the glaze we're going to use is called Cornwall Clear. It's out of uh, College of the Redwoods in uh, Fort Bragg. Um, Bob Zelensky's glaze, and it's just a simple clear. It used Cornwall stone as its main ingredient, so it has kind of a green tinge. 
uh, that's not really a color that's in the feldspar. It's a cone 10 glaze, actually fires from about cone 9 to about cone 11. It's a nice variety and it covers real nice. So that's what we're going to do. So here we go. where I have scratch marks in it is I glaze one way then I glaze the other way to make sure that they're they're absolutely filled so now you can't see the design anymore and uh, that's good and I basically glaze till I can't see the design not a lot of glaze again this was full and now it's here so we're talking less than a half a cup of glaze for the inside and outside of this pot twice so uh, you don't need a lot of glaze, you don't want a lot of glaze, you don't want it glopped up. You want to be able to see the design on a nice, clean, clear surface. And uh, that's what we'll have. And if all goes well, we got a sink that will last about 5,000 years. Guaranteed. Um, give or take a century. Okay. <laughs> so now, uh, this will go into the next firing, and this will be fired in an electric kiln. Because these glazes are clear glazes and white glazes, there's no benefit particularly in firing them in a reduction kiln. And we'll talk about that when we get a reduction glaze in the future. But uh, And this will be fired to cone 10, and it'll be held at cone 10 for about, oh, probably about 20 minutes just to make sure everything's smooth, and then drop down real slow. I go through... Uh, the two layers of quartz inversion very, very slow. So it takes about 30 hours to fire, but I fire very, very slow. Us old guys, we're in no hurry. Thanks. And cut.